Now that you've created your account on churchmembershipdirectory.com, it's now time to go ahead and create your church. Now this data is going to be primarily displayed on the home page of your directory. As you can see here, I'm just using fake data for demonstration purposes. But once you're done entering in that information, go ahead and click Create My Church. That's going to submit your details and bring you to your church's homepage or dashboard. You'll see those details displayed in the top left hand corner. And if you want to edit those at any time, just click on Edit Details, which will take you to a page to do so. But let's go back to the church. I want to show you the directory and kind of where those details display. Here's the home page, and as you can see, there's the church's name, the address, the phone number, and the website. Now there are some slight modifications that you can make, such as putting a logo instead of the church name, or even adding some text at the bottom if you'd like to do so. But that's kind of in the directory settings, and I'm going to show you that after you have your member data imported. So if you haven't done that yet, jump over to the video where I show you how to do that.